Good morning, friends. I'm actually on my way to get my cup of coffee this morning. Um, we are in the process of a big move, my family. I am experiencing what all of my lovely clients get to experience firsthand and am moving households. Um, I tell you, this is no small job when you've been in the same house for 15 years. Yes, I've been in my house that long. And we've got a lot of crap, man. I just, it's nuts. Anyway, so my coffee maker is packed, so I have to go get coffee, but I still wanted to hop on here real quick and give you a quick update on the monies that are needed when purchasing a home. I've had a lot of clients ask me the last few days, Jen, I don't have 20%. What exactly do I need to put down on a house? So have no fear, folks. Um, it's quite simple. We have programs that go down to as little as 3% down, um, all the way up to 20%, 50%, whatever it is that you're looking for there. And different loan programs, including FHA, which is a 3.5% down program. A lot of first time home buyers use this one. We've got conventional financing. That's the one that's 3%, goes all the way up to 20%, 30%, whatever your heart desires. We've got VA financing, which is for our veterans out there. Thank you for your service. And that one is a no money down um, if they choose. We've also got down payment assistance programs out there. Obviously there are qualifiers for this program, so not everybody is a fit. But if you are excellent on making your payments, just don't have a ton of cash in the bank, this is a great option for you. Um, these are, like I said, just a quick snapshot of the loan programs that are out there and how much you need down. There are fees beyond this that are needed when purchasing a house. Um, those include the inspection fee, which runs anywhere between $400 and $600. We've got the appraisal, which is an upfront fee, which is gonna run you between five and $600. We've got the termite inspection, which is about $70. You will need to have funds in your bank account for your escrow deposit. That goes into the title company and there's a good faith um, deposit that does go towards your final closing costs. And then we also have the fees to get the loan. So it's not just a simple down payment process is all that you need. There are fees beyond that. This is why it's super important to talk to your real estate agent. Hopefully it's me. If not, I understand. Not everybody loves me and I get it. Um, but it's, it's something you definitely need to have a chat about before even uh, dipping your toe in the water because you need to know if your budget is going to work in the market that we're in. If you have any questions or just like I said, simply need to talk this out, I'm here for you. And remember, if you are looking for a real estate agent, ooh, agent, agent who is joyful, who is somebody that you can rely on during the transaction and whose approach is always genuine, I'm your girl, folks. Off to get my coffee now, because clearly I need it. I hope you all have a great day. Bye.